Hello Pisces, it is your girl Blue Phoenix and I am back today with a message for us. Um, today's message is going to be a little different. I wanted to tap in with your spirit team and um, get a message that you need to hear right now, okay? So honestly, my intentions are to uplift you, encourage you love on you and let you know how freaking awesome you truly are all right these messages will be coming from your spirit team things you just need to know right now something that can help you um to move on to the next thing in life or help you in whatever you have going on right now so <laughs> if you're here this message was meant just for you okay um all right so let's get into it Already on pre-shuffle, you have aventuring, fortune, all right? It says, chance is the first step you take. Luck is what comes afterwards, all right? So fortune is here. Also, seven of wands is on the bottom of this deck after pre-shuffle, okay? And on the bottom of this deck, is I am in the process of radical transformation. I am awakening to who I truly am. Ashe, Ashe, Ashe. So just these three cards alone, Pisces, tells me that for one, you might need to get some security for all this money coming in. Nah, <laughs> for real talk, the fortune card is definitely, um, it, to me, it's giving me two different meanings. Um, it could be a, a, a literal um, increase in finances, all right? But to me, it's bigger than that. There is a huge, I feel like this is the energy that I'm picking up on. I feel as though you are the fortune, right? I feel as though what you give, Pisces, you give it in your own special way. I don't care how many other people are doing it. I don't care where you are in the world, okay? The way that you do something is not like others, right? Know that, own that, be proud of that, okay? All right, you are a fortune, all right? Okay, seven of wands. Seven of Wands is very much standing your ground, right? But it's giving me an energy. Uh, I mean, it could also be like protection, you know what I'm saying? Fighting against the enemy, however you want to look at it. But it's very much giving me an energy of knowing, you know what I'm saying? Your worth, knowing who you are and not allowing anyone any circumstance anything any words is what i just heard okay to tell you differently all right so there to me there's a big message here um of a transformation that you are going through or will be going through soon that is going to put you in a place of like the highest confidence <laughs> the highest confidence right of surety of um not just knowing who you are but like real life owning it and not dimming your light for anyone no matter what anybody else thinks right so let's continue and see what other messages come out from your spirit team all right to help you along your current path okay spirit <clears throat> Please help me tap in with Planet Pisces, my beautiful, wonderful, loving Pisces. Help me to get the messages to them clearly from their spirit team, their ancestors, their angels, any past over loved ones or divine beings of the highest, brightest light that would like to come through to assist. Come on come on okay all right this is the nine of wands it says i confidently push forward to complete my task the nine of wands is very much someone who has been beaten battered, and torn down <laughs> you know what i'm saying in in life even if it's not like your life story you know there has been some significant 
situation, event, person, place, thing that has caused some kind of mark that, excuse me, left. Okay, caused. I don't know now. All right. <laughs> uh, that could be significant for someone, but that has left a mark. And I just heard not a clean mark. Okay. That could have um, even left trauma with you traumatized you in a way um abuse could have been a factor and abuse is more than just physical right so let's see you're an overcomer pisces all right no matter how you feel right now you are an overcomer okay wow and you're a giver as well at that i share my fortunes my for okay come on come on now fortune C come on now fortune okay you see that i don't know if y'all can see that fortune down there because it's green but fortune i share my fortune all right now it's something about you having unwavering faith and continuing to move forward something might be jagged something might be rough something may not always look like feel like be like what you want it to be in that present moment but better believe boo you are building um your foundation right now is what i'm hearing you're establishing something here right i also just heard please know that you're not doing this alone you have so much help in the spirit realm all right i'm not sure if you you know um communicate with your spirit team often but if you don't you definitely should because they be talking to you i don't know if you talk back but you should <laughs> okay they want you to know that you're supported they're doing everything they can to help you get to where you want to go all right so trust that believe it okay all right Wow. All right. That's, oh, Lord, Chiastolite. <laughs> That's a beautiful stone. All right. Unwavering tenacity. It's definitely giving me nine of wands. Be proud of yourself. Be proud of yourself. Coming from the nine of wands to the seven of pentacles right okay i look at my progress with gratitude instead of frustration right and always remember an attitude of gratitude literally it's like um nitrous oxide for your manifestations <laughs> like literally it boosts the energy and um i don't want to necessarily say the speed but it sometimes the speed of your manifestations right that attitude of gratitude um yeah but looking at your progress with gratitude instead of frustration. More messages for Pisces, please, from their spirit team. What they need to hear from them right now, spirit. Your intuition is very strong, Pisces. You got the pearl down here with intuition. We'll get to that in a minute. I live a soft and receptive life. In this season that you are possibly in already or going towards, it just depends on where you fall, you know, in the timeline. So put the energy where it goes, right? But in this season, there is going to be a need from you i'm sorry a need for you i'm like that didn't sound right but <laughs> there's gonna be a need for you to receive to allow right um once again they're bringing back the nine of wands to my attention to my um you know my mind's eye you have been bamboozled before um, the Pisces I'm picking up on right now. You've been lied to, right? Uh, which most of us have, right? But the 
misuse of your energy by others has possibly caused you to, you know, not be so open with trust in everyone, which I don't think we should trust everyone. That's why, what? Intuition, okay? All right, definitely pay attention to your intuition, honor it, right? Because it's gonna tell you, it's gonna lead you down the right path. It's gonna show you um, who is for you and who is not, right? We also use our discernment for that as well, right? Okay, all right, but in this new season, there's a need for you to get in the energy of receiving. Open your hands, open your hands and get ready to receive these blessings, this fortune, right? This overflow is what I'm hearing, right? Know that you're worthy of this as well, okay? of gifts, of love, of whatever it is that you desire. More messages for Pisces, please. Trust the process before seeing the manifestations. Trust, faith, right? My God, what did I tell you? I am supported by the angelic realm. You're not doing this alone. All right. Let's get some tarot. This card right here, <clears throat> Pearl says, intuition is seeing with the soul. <laughs> Messages for Pisces from their spirit team, please. in the near future for Pisces, please. Come on. Come on. Thank you, God. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> five, right? Somebody's name could start with V. But five is the number of change, Pisces. You are truly going through a radical transformation. You're being enlightened. You're being uplifted. Even if you don't feel it in this physical realm, I'm telling you, it's something also about your light body, okay? And when I say that, I mean like your aura, your essence, your spirit, okay? Uh, growing, right? And when our light bodies are expanding, there may be certain things we can do in this physical realm to assist it, right? Like eating whole foods, veggies, um, plants is what I was about to say, but... <laughs> Same difference, right? Veggies, fruits, um, you know, things that are uh, nourishing for your body. Um, just being aware of what you're putting in your body, right? And definitely hydrate, especially when you're going through a spiritual ascension, okay? All right, but the Hierophant, big Taurus energy. Taurus likes the finer things in life, baby, okay? Fortune, You understand me? Look at all them gold keys up under the Hierophant. And you got all them hoes, Pisces. All of, look at them now. Look at them damn keys now. Okay. I'm just saying now. <laughs> all right. Okay. Something is, is in your favor. If it's not now, it will be. I promise you that. Know it. Own it. This man took everybody's keys and, I, <laughs> and the spirit just corrected me. Spirit said, no, they gave them to him. Come on now. Come on now, God. You know what I'm saying? Wow. Um, Pisces, there's a message here for you to give something to God. Like, 
if there's a worry, a fear, okay, anxiety about anything, God wants you to give it to him, her, them, they, okay? <laughs> give it to source, to the most high, all right? There could be a position <clears throat> that needs to be filled, all right? It's something about you qualifying for a position or something. And this doesn't have to be like work. This could be a a parent to an orphan, um, um, a caretaker of an elderly person. Just, I don't know, something to where you're going to be able to shine, right? And when I say that, I mean like your, your natural gifts are going to shine in this position. It is going to be enjoyable, right? It's going to be something that makes your soul sing, that makes you happy, genuinely, <clears throat> And in the process of this, what's so good about it is that you're, you, it's, uh, it's like equal reciprocity because you're giving, you're going to be giving and you're going to be receiving, <clears throat> but it's it the giving that you're going to be doing. It's like a natural thing. You know what I'm saying? It's not anything that you don't want to do. If that makes sense. I hope that made sense. Okay. The Hierophant is, uh, is official. I just heard officiant, okay? All right, for some of y'all, this position that you're taking is not in this realm. <clears throat> for some of y'all, it's not in this physical realm. Somebody here is like, I don't even know how this works, but what I'm hearing is some kind of like spiritual promotion, right? Okay, Spirit is saying like, in the form of even knowledge or something, okay? <clears throat> you, I heard you connect worlds, okay? So you could be good at, how do you say? Mediating or seeing, thank you, Spirit, seeing both sides of a story, right? Seeing the bigger picture of something, all right? I just heard cooler heads prevail. <clears throat> so you could have a gift of even doing it. I just heard a school counselor or a principal or something like that. Like I'm seeing somebody in a school that's like, uh, honestly, I'm seeing somebody break up a fight. <laughs> like two kids fighting or something. All right. I heard security, but not like a security guard or an officer. I don't know how to explain that part of spirit. I don't know. But so I don't know. It's something about, I don't know, making other people feel safe. Okay. You have the wisdom of many, many lifetimes, many years, many, I heard many moons. Okay. A cancer could be significant. All right. Or you could be tapping into your, you know, tapping into cancer energy. That's a very loving and nurturing um, energy, right? High vibing cancer energy. <laughs> You're being crowned, Pisces. is something that's just within your reach, right? All right, keep your eyes on the prize, okay? Somebody name could be Toby or Mac, okay? I just thought of Toby's, Toby Mac song, Eye On It. That just came to mind, okay? It's also something that's very, I heard, peculiar about your attire, all right? <clears throat> and I mean that in a good way, like, it's just, I don't know, what looks good on you would look crazy on someone else is what I'm hearing. Like, I don't know. It's something about the way that you, I don't know, either carry yourself or you wear something or 
Sorry, y'all. All right. 52 or 25 could be significant. All right, I heard sage, okay? Like the wisdom of a sage or a yogi, all right? Okay, like a shaman even. All right, let's continue. Thank you, spirit. Pisces, near future, please. I love you, Pisces. <laughs> near future for Pisces, please. The Page of Pentacles. Some of y'all have a gift for working with children. Some of y'all have a gift for working with children. But the Page of Pentacles, <clears throat> excuse me, is a humble, it's like humble beginnings, right? These beginnings are stable, right? They're not built on faulty grounds, right? The highest of quality materials are being used here, right? This is something that this, this new season or this season, y'all just put the energy where it goes. This season is like, okay, somebody got like a start startup business or something I just heard, okay? Or you could be just now starting a business or something like that, okay? Especially with this hierophant here, all right? Green or red could be somebody's favorite color. All right, but oh, and also the Page of Pentacles brings good news. But yes, this gives me very much humble beginnings, but a beginning that is not just, uh, what do you call those plate Like a pop-up shop or something. No, this is something that is going to stand the test of time, right? All right, you could be in the learning stages of something though, right? Because the Page of Pentacles is young. He is, um, you know, he's curious. He wants to learn, right? He wants to be like the, the King of Pentacles or even the Knight of Pentacles, but he's just starting, right? <clears throat> All right, but the Page of Pentacles brings good news, Pisces. You got the Queen of Cups on the bottom. Mm. Near future for Pisces, please. Roses could be your favorite flower. All right, cherries, okay. And you have the Knight of Wands. L listen, if this ain't maturity. <laughs> oh my gosh. You go from the Page of Pentacles to the Knight of Wands. Right? You may even receive help or an idea or some kind of like assistance from a younger person. It could be adolescent even but i'm getting more like young adult with this knight of pentacle i mean the knight of wands here right and then the knight of wands is fire right it's um adventure it is um trying new things that's what i think of with wands you know in the younger like you know the page and the knight of wands like they're learning and you're going from a page of pentacles to a knight of wands. You're establishing something and now you're getting creative with that shit. <laughs> and then he has five stars, okay? 55. All right, nice change. Give me a moment, oh. You have the knight, I'm sorry, I'm gonna get it together. Ippy, ippy. <laughs> the uh, king of swords on the bottom, that's Aquarius, Libra, Gemini energy. 
I just heard fit for a king, fit for a queen, right? Like you're training to be a king or a queen, you know, of course, depending on your gender or what you identify as. Mm. You're learning how to wield your wand. That's what I just heard. Wield your wand, right? Like focus your intentions. Um, 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 thinking about the things you do want, right? Not the things you don't, right? Because where your attention goes, your energy flows. This is giving me very much um, someone who is learning how well they manifest the power of their manifestations. Somebody here can think about something. Ain't, all of us can, but I feel like this is intense. This energy I'm picking up on right now. Like, and your manifestations will pop off just like this, but it's something about focus here. It's something about focus, definitely with the King of Swords on the bottom, right? Like, you may have so many because the Knight of Wands is like, da, da, da. you know what I'm saying? He he is whoa Nelly, okay, <laughs> right? Um, So you may get a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of ideas. Uh, You may have a lot of desires, right? Like what you want for your future. There's something here about focusing that or something of that nature. Like um, maybe like, let's say you have 20 things you want to accomplish in 2024. Okay, cool. Instead of focusing on all 20 of those right now, I'm getting the energy of like, don't overwhelm yourself, right? Because the Knight of Wands, while he is ready to go, he's energetic. He is, you know, in a he's bright and bubbly and shit, whatever, right? <clears throat> he he can also be a little inconsistent, right? So there's something here about not putting too much on your plate so you don't get overwhelmed or just like forget all that stuff. You know what I'm saying? All right. So um, instead of doing all 20, maybe break it down, you know, into I should have picked a better number, but <laughs> to evenly uh, divide this. But say you do like five a quarter. Oh, OK. That actually did divide right. Five a quarter, right? <laughs> So, yeah. All right. What's coming for us? Pisces, please. Near future. You have two cards. This is nice. All right. King of Swords is still on the bottom of the deck, right? You have the Two of Cups and the Three of Pentacles. Let me hold them up better for you. So you can see them Three of Pentacles. All right. Two of Cups and the Three of Pentacles. Remember that being open part. <clears throat> There's new energy coming in for you in this season, Pisces. It is definitely going to require you, especially if I'm talking to somebody who is used to doing everything on their own. Hello, I'm one of them, so I feel you, boo. We're going to get through this shit together, okay? <laughs> We're going to learn together, okay? But... <clears throat> Not only is your spirit team assisting you and working with you, but they're directing others in this physical realm to do the same. So expect blessings, expect assistance, expect help, right? The law of assumption, it is already done. So just know, right? Know it. Re like claim this shit y'all receive this message this is your message if you are here of course pick up what resonate now <laughs> but the three of pentacles with the two of cups is partnerships that's collaborating that's working together i heard for a common good all right so these people this person whoever 
is gonna have the same, y'all are gonna be on the same wavelength, right? It's gonna occur in a way that's gonna be so like, you can't deny it. You're gonna know that God sent this, this person or these people to you. You have the two of swords. Some of y'all may, um, especially those who, you know, used to doing it alone, make, you know, what's the word I'm looking for? May not be so open to um, assistance, right? Follow your intuition and definitely use your discernment because just like, our light, you know what I'm saying? Like we attract light, we also attract dark. So of course the enemy gonna try it. The devil is gonna test you. You know what I'm saying? That's I don't know why, but that's what this two of swords is giving me for some reason. But you see how it got that red bow around it? It's like it something's coming together, right? The crossroads could be significant, okay? A shoe. Issue, all right, could be significant. Elegua. There's going to be some sort of tie. You and somebody are like this. Now, I don't know if Spirit is saying, I don't know, if, like, it's almost like I'm getting reflection. I'm, I, I'm almost getting inseparable with this, all right? It's like a bond. I just heard an unspoken bond or something. This is beautiful. What's coming towards Pisces spirit? Near future messages from their spirit team, please. We got the five of pentacles. Somebody may reach out to you. This is, this is, when I say use your discernment, because you, you know what I'm saying? Like you attract the light, you can attract the dark as well. It's something about somebody like reaching up or reaching out to you or something. Somebody wants to grow something with you, but what's so, it's sad because I feel like this person, bless them, Lord. They, oh, they so cute. Um, They wanna, they wanna grow bless them but I feel like it's uh, how do I say this their vibration is not conducive that's not the word I wanted to use but it's not beneficial right it's almost like you would be lowering your vibration to take this you know what i'm saying like to invest in this person here in this energy give me a minute tell us about the five of pentacles please spirit we're gonna break this one down now <laughs> You have the Queen of Pentacles. Tell me about the Five of Pentacles, please, Spirit, for Pisces. For someone, though, here, you're going to be working on your mindset, right? Somebody, you're, I feel like, I don't, like, somebody's coming from lack and walking into abundance. 
took out like the queen of pentacles and the five of pentacles that's just a side note because this is still an increase you hear what i'm saying like that's a big ass increase too the nine of swords somebody could already feel you leaving separating all right um not even i don't want to say it like that because i don't feel like you like leaving this person but i feel like you are ascending right and when you ascend right let's say you have a group of friends and you go through a spiritual awakening or you increase your knowledge on something and whatever you grow you mature you don't necessarily vibe the same with those same things could be people that you've known your whole life but when you grow and others aren't growing with you that shit you start look like feeling like damn like i don't want to like small talk is not my thing anymore like can we talk about business can we talk about you know what i'm saying like helping our community can we talk about giving back to people can we talk about like expanding our consciousness <laughs> it's something like that this could even be a mother all right This person could actually be well off. It's so crazy though, because I feel like they still, they have some sort of like, belief that is limited. They have a limited belief. All right. You have judgment in the King of Wands. So the King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Give me a minute, okay? Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, mm. Uh, please know this. Please know this. This work that you're doing on yourself, others are going to see it, right? Is they going to they're gonna notice it that it's hello ba -ba -na -na. they're gonna notice it people who you have outgrown are gonna notice like this king of wands is legit staring at this queen of pentacles here Like something is gonna get other people's attention. Tell me more about the Five of Pentacles, please. The Nine of Swords. Bless them, Lord. Somebody don't want you to move on. Somebody doesn't want you to move on. Somebody doesn't want you to move on, but you are. This is healing. This is going from five of pentacles to the queen of pentacles, literally. Our healing waters, okay? So like a spiritual bath or going and getting in a pool or an ocean or something like that, right? Of course, you know, I know it ain't warm everywhere, but <laughs> do what you can with what you got, right? <laughs> Throw some uh, Himalayan sea salt in your bath water and be right there at the beach, okay? In your head. Practice your visualizations, <laughs> okay? I'm telling you, Pisces, now we ruled by Neptune, huh? Okay? That's literally like the planet of the daydreaming and visualization <laughs> shit. <laughs> you better get it to it, Pisces. Somebody is literally worried. Bless them, Lord. It is what it is. Pisces, you're growing. Right, you're expanding. Um, when I tell you, they looking or they will be looking. Wow, 
And not only <clears throat> if this is you with the five of pentacles, because this is, <clears throat> excuse me, somebody here going to be called to a high position, though. Like, real talk, somebody here, like I was saying with the Hierophant, you have a, a position to fill. And people are looking for you. Right? You know how you get this position? Get Match that vibration of that position. I don't know what the vibration is, but shit, getting a high vibration, you can't go wrong. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm just saying. Last few cards, spirit. It's coming towards Pisces, please, near future. Wow. The Ace of Cups. Be open to receive. Remember, my cup runneth over. I think I said that earlier. Abundance. Over abundant. I share my fortune with others. Remember that? The fortune card. Like, easy is what I just heard. in the near future. Can you clarify the eight of Ace of Cups? Whoa. When I tell you what I tell you, bruh, my cup runneth over. That's many major much. That's a lot. That's overwhelming. You may get overwhelmed by the amount of support and love you receive. Jeez. Somebody name could start with an X. Or they have an X in their name. The hangman. This is so much. So much you may even want to like like pause the uh, the love I'm telling you and when I say it's, it's giving me it's giving me like a lot for some reason I don't know but it's giving me someone that's getting like even a lot of messages of love right and you know how your phone ding Every time somebody texts you, call you, whatever, you know what I'm saying? Like notifications is something here. Like you may even want to like silence your notifications, right? That's just an example. But I hope you get what I'm trying to say. Like something may be like really a lot. <laughs> love, forget something. We talking about love here, right? Tell me more spirit. This could even be online, Pisces. All right. It's like something's about to come back full circle too. Like if there was something in the past that you didn't do, that you wanted to do, that you felt passed you by, it did not. Something did not pass you by. An opportunity, a person, a job, something. Something's coming back full circle. Something may come in and not look as appeasing as you would 
would expect it to or something. It's something about something not being t a temptation or something. I don't know. Again, cherries. Okay. Cherry. Sherry. Sherry. All right. Even wine as well. Um, I'm definitely getting the energy though, Pisces, to just recognize, use your discernment, your intuition. You got the five of cups here on the bottom of the deck because you're going to receive a lot of eyes on you. And like we know, everybody doesn't have your best intention, but just use your discernment, your intuition feel people out bro like their energy right like i'm hearing love is an action word right so it's like check a person by their actions as well or something like that all right i'm also getting a message about somebody bringing baggage to you okay like wanting to dump something on you or something all right so definitely seven of wands that ass okay <laughs> protect your energy especially if you like are an empath because something could be a little bit emotionally uh taxing all right and if if as an empath right if you don't reel that shit in and like control it like you know what i'm saying like disconnect especially from somebody who just wants to like just dump their problems onto you that shit will pull you into a hermit mode or a damn hey man real real quick because you have to go recharge the heck out of your battery okay but I feel like, honestly, for those of y'all that have dealt with people like that in the past, I feel like it that's over with. I feel like you're going to, what I'm saying is, I feel like you're going to recognize it and you're going to be able to call it out before you get to where you want to, like your cups are empty. You know what I'm saying? Like you're going to call it out before they get to the third damn cup, before they get to the second one. Like, all right, I gave you one cup now. Tonight, you listen, I'm praying for that ass, but go on to sleep now because I, uh-uh, no. Okay, and then you got the number five again. All right, so let me get you another affirmation. We're going to close this out. Listen, come on, come on six of cups i am safe and free of worry i am carefree and playful i am connected with my youthful spirit mm. have fun pisces right that's what this life is supposed to be about we're supposed to be having fun fucking relaxing and when i say that i mean like your mind you know what i'm saying your body your spirit right of course there are gonna be stresses in the world but it's not supposed to take us out you know like enjoy your life baby okay last message for pisces please Mm, that's beautiful. I walk confidently through new doors of opportunity. Three of Pentacles. The Freak. 
African sun. We can't get a better ending than that. All right, I am successful, radiant, and abundant. I am in touch with my inner child. Y'all go out there and have some fun. Now. Get in touch with that little girl, that little boy inside of you. The one that wasn't nurtured as much as they needed to be when they were younger. Go have fun with them. Go to the park. Go to the trampoline park. Go get some bubbles. Go jump rope. Go skip, bruh. Make a mud pie. Talk to the animals. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Climb a damn tree. Y'all will be surprised what that little stuff right there would do for your spirit. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Right? And then talk to your invisible friends. You know what I'm saying? And I'm talking about your spirit guys and stuff like that. They're my homies. They're my besties. You understand me? Real talk. <laughs> Plot play imaginary uh with uh with them all the time. Should act like they're right here with me. <laughs> they're my best friends. Shit. Anyway, Pisces, I love y'all, man. I love y'all so much. Don't forget to like the video, share the planet. If you need a personal reading, look down below in the description box. And also, don't forget to get your DPC merch because you are directed, protected, and connected, Pisces, always to the most high. All right? So, I love you, my love, and I will talk to you down below or in the next video. Bye, Pisces.